You're a real person. I am. Wow. Oh my Finally. gosh. How are you? It's so weird to see you in real life. Same. Wow, oh wow, oh wow. This city, every single time I come to New York City, it is loud, it, it's extremely busy, and uh, it smells, but I love it. <laughs> we just got to our Airbnb, we got to New York about two and a half hours ago. Four hour bus ride, it was horrendous. I also forgot my neck pillow, so it hurt, but now we are officially in the Airbnb for the night. We just came to drop our stuff off and then head out. Oh, by the way, I forgot uh, I forgot to say, hi, my name is Timothy. Welcome to my channel. I do film related and vlog related stuff on this channel. <laughs> and uh, did I just snot all over myself? And today we are in New York City because we are going to a workshop held by one of my most favorite Instagrammers and YouTubers. I'm not, I'm not gonna tell you who it is till we get there, so it'll be a surprise, but that's what we're in New York for today. And, and later on, I get to meet my cousin and see my aunt who doesn't even know I'm coming. She hasn't seen me in 13 years. That sounds about right. She hasn't seen me since I was 13. She hasn't seen me since I first got my ears pierced. It was actually when I went to go stay with them in India for a week or two. And I, I kind of just left the house and got my ears pierced. So that should be fun too. Uh, but room tour, let's let's do an Airbnb room tour. This is what it looks like when you walk through. That is another room, I haven't gone in it. That might be someone else's. This is the view of New York, Upper, where are we? Lower East Side? Upper, upper West Side. We are at the Upper West Side. Your kitchen. Mm, they're doing laundry. Bathroom. Um, also, Gotta thank Peter McKinnon for the whole switch in the microphone backwards. This helps a lot. Okay, let's go see the rest of the place. So let's take a look at where we're gonna be staying. Up there on a little loft, but I have to say that these steps are not friendly because you can barely fit an entire foot on them. Oh, hello. That's the bedroom. I can barely, I can barely even stand. And I am not a tall person. I'm like, what? Five, five, seven, five, eight. I am not tall at all. But you, on the other hand, it's like, it's perfect for you. You can stand all the way straight legs. And it's the perfect height. Because I can't move. <laughs> uh, but yeah, and it's got, it's got the most awesome little lofty feel. Uh, I'm thoroughly enjoying it. But now, I think it's time for us, I think it's time for us to go and catch an Uber down to Chelsea. And uh, I'm excited. I am extremely excited.
Yeah, yeah, let's give it up again. Uh, this is my second time in New York, so I'm very happy to be here. I'm so happy to see so many faces. Thank you for coming. It makes it means the world to me. As you know, I, I don't know. Actually, how many people know me from... Okay. Yeah! We got a lot. Okay, cool. I just don't know if there's people that don't know me. Uh, so I work by myself uh, very often. Too much, actually. Uh, I kind of go crazy a little bit. That's why I'm so weird. Uh, uh, being able to collaborate with someone else is just so refreshing because you get to bounce ideas off each other and bring something beautiful, create together instead of just having yourself. Because uh, I can definitely, you can get stuck in your own thoughts. So reaching out to people and just seeing what they can teach you as well has been so, so inspiring for me. Second pose. I'm looking forward to this one. <laughs> It's so weird to see you in real life. Same. <laughs> Same. Ma Macro? No, Mac. What? McKetty. McKetty. On Timothy. Yeah, yeah. Timothy okay. McKenzie. It's just Mac Mackenzie. That's what yeah. it always comes up when you tag me. And <laughs> don't speak. <laughs> I know you. <laughs> and I've seen, I've seen your video that you sent through as well. Did you? I did. And I have something to tell you about that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll wait. I can wait. Hi. You're so handsome. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Thank you, you. You, you look amazing. Um, hi. Okay, so. Is it okay if yes, I Yes, of, of course. Okay. okay. So, you wanted to apply for the mentorship. Yeah. And this is, you put in so much effort and time. And I'm going to mentor you. <laughs> You're going to be my guinea pig. <laughs> yes. Yeah, and I was going to tell you that, but I was in such a dark space and not uh, ready to take anyone on. And it's still, the fact that you came, I wasn't ready, but I, I want to give back. And you have done so much for me and your support has been endless so Thank because you. and it's funny she just asked if I do mentorship and I said no but because I need to test it and I need to figure out the strategy so you're gonna be my strategy <laughs> I'm gonna yeah <laughs> yeah I'm so happy yeah it's okay amazing thank you so thanks for coming I'll keep in touch hey man I'll send you some messages <laughs> yes please Yup, that is an actual milestone moment in my life, and I got it on video. It's been a whole four days since I met Sorella, and I waited this long to put this vlog out because I wanted to give myself enough time to process that entire day, night, or five minutes that uh, I met her. I'm still in disbelief that that conversation even happened, and even more, emotionally and like mentally confused that what she said to me is actually what she said to me. Believe me, I debated whether or not I wanted to leave that last section in about her telling me that she would be my mentor because I didn't want to hype it up too much. I'm not I'm not the kind of person that really does that. So, I thought I'd leave it, I'd archive that footage and then later in a couple months put it out then but I figured if I'm going to vlog and if I'm going to make this channel my own and tell my story and tell my journey, it has to be documented as it happens. And even though it would have been cool to kind of be like, oh yeah, by the way, this is what she said to me months later, I figured I'd just throw it in there and say a huge thank you to her. Like, I still cannot get over the fact that this is going to happen. This is in my future. I don't know when it's going to happen, how it's going to happen. Uh, but it's going to happen. It was, uh, man, it's, it's so surreal to me. Ah, all the hard work is paying off and it is such a relief. And I'm extremely glad I did not quit Instagram or YouTube when I, when I, when I was so sure I was going to do it. Hey, <laughs> uh, anyway, that's the vlog. Uh, so don't forget to hit the subscribe button blah 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 also if you don't follow Sorel her Instagram page is in the description below Ugh. this is awesome <laughs> peace dude